Hi everyone, it's Science Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio, Ascendant, Sun, Moon, Venus, Rising, and those of you cross-watching, welcome to your tarot love messages. In today's reading, we are going to take a look and see why is your person acting weird lately, okay? So what's going on with them? Um, perhaps what's going on between the both of you? It is going to be a general reading, guys, so please keep that in mind. If you're after a personalized tarot reading with myself, please feel free to reach out and inquire. I will list my email address below the video. Alright, that's about it. Your person is coming across as very self-conscious right now in particular. Um, it does feel like... Okay. It does feel like they're maybe needing to spend a little bit more time on their own right now. They could be going through some things internally. Um, they may have a hard time trusting people. They may also have a hard time trusting themselves, their emotions, and what they feel. They potentially could be trying to sneak away. Um, maybe they're trying to get away with something that they know they shouldn't be doing. Maybe they feel like, you know, there is something going on with how they feel about you. There could be emotional uncertainty here. There could be some um, confusion, but instead of talking to you about it, it feels like this person is trying to sneak away from the problem instead of trying to address it. Okay, I feel like there's also a trust issue. The Seven of Swords does indicate trust issue. It can mean that, you know, this person is also after a casual relationship. You might not necessarily be after something casual. Maybe you want something a little bit more committed and a little bit more stable, but this person is choosing not to, um, this person is choosing sort of not to, you know, tell you what's really going on with them emotionally, or really this person is avoiding setting intentions for their connection because, um, you know, this is someone who I see as not wanting to share their feelings or their thoughts with you. At this particular stage, it may not have anything to do with you though, or this connection. It could mean that this person, maybe you don't know this person very well, okay? Or maybe this person is someone who doesn't feel like they could easily trust anyone. I do see that this is someone who can be quite dishonest. Um, I also see that this is someone, look, it's not to say that they're purposely or intentionally being dishonest, but maybe they're also dishonest with themselves and their feelings. Um, there's just something here that's not quite, that's something here isn't quite making a lot of sense, and it's hard to put your finger on it, right? Maybe this is someone who's just all of a sudden, out of nowhere, started acting very weird and very strange. Um... There's a clumsiness to the energy. Someone here is afraid of getting in trouble. Look, even if they haven't necessarily done anything wrong, okay? So they may feel bad for feeling whatever it is that they feel, okay? Which I feel like is a little bit, it's an emotionally scattered energy that they're assuming right now. So they, you know, may have emotional feelings for you, but they may not be as strong as they would like for them to be at this particular point in time or you know this is this person is also you know having a hard time maybe identifying what it is that they do feel for you and what the what they want for the future of this connection but again they're trying to it's like they're avoiding talking about it because they don't want to get into trouble they don't want to come across a certain way as well I see that this is someone who avoids staying under the radar and I feel like he or she is very insecure about how to act or how to behave lately, which makes sense why they're acting weird. Not their usual type, they're not their usual self, 
um, they are this person is coming across as a bit of fearful energy who at times I feel like does you know he or she says or does things to please others I'm also seeing that in um, oftentimes this is someone who's very animated or can be quite attention seeking and as a result maybe this person is now very withdrawn and is acting very um, you know not not themselves and therefore you feel as though something is going on I don't see that this person you know I don't see that they want to have a conversation I don't know I don't think that they're faking it to be honest with you I don't think that they're faking what they feel for you or they're not faking you know the connection here I just feel like this person is very confused they're also because they're confused emotionally they're also confused about how to act for some of you look because of the seven of swords energy it could be that they have done something here that I'm not proud of okay it could be that they have done something in the wrong and this person doesn't necessarily want to owe up to that okay because it is a bit of a shadowy figure with the seven of swords trying to sneak away from this military camp so you maybe this player this person is a player type maybe this person is someone who has cheated on you or cheated on you with you or you know has cheated in the past i think you are aware of who you are dealing with so i don't think for some of you i don't think it's entirely a surprise maybe you're just hopeful that you know they will change or they will become i think you're aware okay you're aware of the type of person that you're dealing with or you you have some idea of who this person is or what it is that they want I don't think this is someone who's always honest and open with you and you know with their communication but I do feel like there is this I keep getting this feeling of detached it's this feeling of this energy of feeling detached so maybe this person might be losing interest maybe this person is, in, is engaging in self-sabotaging behavior as well because I do feel like I see them being affected by some sort of situation and it can indicate that this person is creating their own problems so maybe you know there's not that many issues in you know maybe there isn't an issue in the connection altogether but this person is creating an issue um, because this is what they do they indulge in self-sabotaging behavior or emotional patterns be very careful around this type of energy because for some of you I do feel like this is someone who can be maybe shrewd and who can be maybe cunning or someone who is a bit crafty okay let's call it that they feel like you're on to them they do they feel like you're on to them they feel like I don't know if you realize that there are other options okay or I don't know if this is what they're realizing here that there are other options for you definitely the way that the two of you have communicated has changed and even though I think that you know they haven't entirely lost interest in you I do feel like there's something here that's happened that has made them act a bit strange or has made them act a bit weird lately now i don't know if this person thrives on secrets or enjoys the mystery um in a in a romantic connection but it might be a good idea to just approach them in a very open honest and a very straightforward way and just ask them that something you know they're acting different or something is uh, or you feel you know something um something feels different because looking at it from this vantage point I do feel like your person is trying to balance themselves because of some something that they know or something that they've done and this is why they're acting strange they're trying to straighten something out so 
someone here is also readjusting their image of themselves so that they're acting in line with who you think they are or who you want them to be rather than who they really are and i don't know if this is is done in a way to impress you or try and woo you over okay guys and these are your messages thanks so much for watching and listening please show your support by liking sharing and subscribing to the channel bye